All right. Week two of Aeon League. Game seven or eight of the week. We have a Stephanie versus Pepper Mayo. Am I supposed to pick all six or just four? I completely forgot. Yes. Wait a minute. Uh, you guys need to restart because the rules aren't set to flat rules. Alright. Because, uh, you're only supposed to be bringing, be able to bring in six, not f yeah. four, not six. Yeah, that, I thought it was weird. Okay. Yeah, so when game starts, just end battle and, uh, redo it. Interesting. May I stop? <laughs> Wait a minute, but they're showing four Pokeballs. But they're bringing in six. I'm so confused. With no audio. <laughs> Here, I can, I can cheat the system. So I just end battle? We just chose four four Pokemon. I think it'd be fine. Okay, well. <laughs> okay, knocks off on the Gyarados. Clear eminence off, which is pretty good. Dragon Dance on Teriyaki. So plus speed, passes on the field. I didn't see what the first move was on the... Ooh. Did he go for sport? Uh, tailwind turn one, because now he's asleep and it's kind of fucked. She did go for tailwind. Hope she doesn't go into Gallade. I hope she knows she has to get to Appleton. Oh, she's just... Okay. What's she knocking off of a... Uh, an Oka Berry? Another D dance, so now it's plus two, plus two. Or the Grafai Eye. Damn. Pokemon's just asleep. <laughs> she should just parting shot, to be honest. Okay, she's, she's setting something up for someone. Let's see what happens here. Is this Terrasalize the Gyarados, or is this Terrasalizing the Amoongus? The Gyarados. So it's Terra... Flying. I think it's going into Gallade. But it only makes sense. Rage Powder. Well, she went to attack it anyways. I guess that's fine. It's like, oh my god, this thing is still faster than Gyarados.
What does Gyarados do? Gyarados flying, it's gonna hit Gallade. Yep. Man. Kinda sucks. I go for the iron defense, but Appleton is gonna not do much here. Oh, okay. She's gotta know, bro. the Appleton this does maybe a fourth about a third not a fourth still asleep kind of sucks let's do a lot of damage Ooh, that's a lot oh my god she has it up because of tailwind oh that's why the delay was faster if that was her I'd probably just keep attacking teriyaki because it's his wound condition Trick? Are they switching? Is it like tail? Oh no. Wait, this is why we give it ripen with the two berries. Yep. Oh, we woke up. No longer has the the Payapa Berry. Leech Seeds and we keep it alive. It has to attack the Gyarados. I hope she knows, because killing it gives her such a hard win condition. And all she would really need to do is maybe set up a Nasty Pot or two, and then just Baton Pass out. Okay, she, she does know about the attacking. I, bro, I'm telling you, Parting Shot's it. Oh my god. No! Why'd you Parting Shot that? In five minutes? <laughs> Steph has like a chance of winning. Little Wisping, the, the Appleton is fine because the Appleton isn't even in need of that. Ugh, she forgot that Dark doesn't affect, or you can't do that on a, um, on a, wow, what's his name? Sableye because he's Dark, so you can't do a prior move on a, on a ball like that. But now, she is technically in the lead, which is really good. He's probably confused why parking shot didn't work. But this is where the real games begin. Can she get out the Hydreigon? Yumo is the Dragonite. Oh no, Yumo is the... Um, She is just going off. Oh. I'm reading the move, figuring it out. Because he has Pryo, knockoff's gonna... That's a lot of damage. That created a lot. So the defense fell. Hyper Voices can kill both of them. Oh my god, it didn't do anything. Like, genuinely. I think she still lives with the Appleton. Knock off. There's nothing to knock off. Throw Spirit was just activated. Still a crit. Mm. 
not a good call because we do know she's just going to use Hyper Voice again and this is going to be quite effective to Hydreigon killing it more than likely. The better option here was just to just use Parting Shot and hope the damage is enough to send in Hydreigon. Oh, nope, she doesn't know what she's doing. I'll play kills Appleton. Fuck, well, it's asleep, so it won't do anything for the next three rounds. I'm gonna lose this. He thinks it's three. It could work. Uh, wake up, but it's definitely yeah. dead to hyper voice. This is a bad call to switch out. The only thing it really can do is just knock off and hope it to get like, like a kill or two. Because it's not going to do much other than that. Because all she's going to use is uh, this, this poison. Oh man, it had poison jab here? Did we not give this thing poison jab? I have a list of Fuck. mods here. Just that. We did give it poison jab, but she gave it knockoff. So, this is her fault. She just waited for the <laughs> sleep to wear off on She lost her first round. But she has knockoff, but when we were doing our notes on her, we told her to take poison jab instead. <laughs> so she forgot to switch out a move to begin with. Maybe I told her knockoff was fine. But she still has a chance, because you have to lose two games. I'm 11 just really cool and work. Hmm. Eat it. Cold. Oh, she's saying the rules. Alright. Crossing my fingers. Stephanie can win this. This that last game she played was pretty good. She just didn't understand that she should have attacked first the Gyarados, because if that happened, she would have killed it earlier. So the Appleton would have never got hit by the move water. Well, it got hit by waterfall. Been back at full, right? So she kills the Gyarados. And then, at that time when she had like 8 HP, or like mm. heard the yellow bar, she wouldn't have that have had that happen because she would have been back to full after killing the Gyarados. So she would have been in a good position. She could have appled acid the Sylveon twice, killed the Sylveon, and then parting shot is just something she doesn't know how to use yet. What is happening here? What the fuck? <laughs> What? Oh, there's her mons. Okay, so she's bringing in Brute Bonnet. Her, her? Dude, I don't know. <laughs> I don't. Or did you just? Or did you guys just trade her all the? Oh, I traded her all the, the stuff that she needed. Does she not know what to do? Well, she's just... She literally said, fuck it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I 
She's so confused. She she wants to add Brute Bonnet to the team, but she can't because she needs to leave. Uh, <laughs> the thing to put him on. <laughs> Wait, I think she figured it out. Nope. Wait. Nope. Come on. <laughs> she just wants the battle. <laughs> if I were Steph, I'd probably start up the, my boy Papaya and maybe like Appleton instead of starting up uh, Dino and Gallade. But Gallade's not a bad pick here. She picks Proclavel, it's also pretty good. Uh, either of the two attackers would be super solid here. She's got two strong defensive mons and then two strong offensive mons. No, even. You know, two, two. You gotta even them out. So she knows if she thinks about it smartly, he's gonna bring in Gyarados. And he's going to bring in the Amoongus. So if he Rage Powders turns one, that's super fine with her because she wants to kill the Amoongus from using Spore. That's like the most important thing. And the issue comes when the Gyarados comes out, which she is starting up the exact same thing. The Gyarados is going to do Dragon Dance, which makes it stronger. So, ooh, like that. Dino is not going to get affected by this because of Wider, which is something that's supposed to be used for a completely different reason. If I were her, I'd probably Draco Meteor. I guess Tailwind's not a bad move here either. But I think you for sure kill the Amoongus. Because then you don't die to tear. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you lost the feed. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> Sorry. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what happened. <laughs> the psycho cut. Oh, so he's gonna. That didn't kill? Terabas flying turn one. I think this kills Gallade. Oh, it's because Intimidate proc, that's why. Damn. But wait, this is so good for her. Did she bring in Gengar or Quackleville? Spores, the. Ah, oh, this kind of sucks for her. Gengar? What did we give Gengar? You don't go. No, bro, don't go. Don't do it. We gave Gengar Icy Wind, which is pretty good. I I think this is a missed call from her. This guy protect. Mhm. Mm good. Ah, uh, not again. It's not what I wanted. Okay, wait, never mind. Get rid of the fungus. So, so now this. she needs the dragon dragon pulse. Annoying. The giant fuck off serpent and Terra steal again because she's not gonna die and she kills it in like two or three hits. Or she, if she knows better, she drag up drag up pulses the dragonite and hopes from the best there and keeps protecting to hope Dino gets a face uh, safe switch in. Okay, this is. Not bad. The issue is she should have terrestrialized to steal because he still has Terra Blast flying. And if he attacks Appleton, Appleton's is dead. The only reason he lived that last time was because of steel. So now it's up to Pepper Mayo if he takes a chance and this is Terra Blast on Appleton instead of Waterfall. Even if Gengar is still alive, that sucks. I don't know if. Gengar has the sweet potential. I think Appleton is dead here. Yeah, if she tries to lie. Yeah, if she should have. I'm going to lose. She still this has a chance of annoying. winning. She just has to icy win. I hope she knows that. I'm going to lose. Nah, she just needs to icy win. Gengar can kill these two mons. Come on. Show me Icy Wind. Show me Icy Wind. If Stephanie Icy wins, she wins this game. Do it. No, come on. Icy Wind. Icy. 
Gengar is faster than everything. Gengar icy wins. This is going to do a good amount of damage. Dragonite's almost dead. The speed is lowered on Teriyaki. There's a chance that Dragonite wakes up and uses Draco Meteor. Kills the big dragon. That's a godsend. That's, That's pretty a godsend. Good. I don't know how that happened. Yeah. So now the thing yeah. comes to Gengar won't die if she yeah. if it's attacked by Terra Blast because of Focus Ash. So this is still super fine. I don't think this dies either. Ooh. <laughs> well. I was I wrong. Love. She still has a chance of winning. Cause of lose. just cause of Focus Ash. Fun. She has such a high chance of winning. She's just hoping for a crit here or something. I see one won't freeze. But there's a good chance she does a good amount of damage to Sableye, and because she'll go first next turn too after this. Unless he quashes next turn. A okay, waterfalls just won't. <laughs> what is happening? What happens? I love. No. Oh, Are you fucking that's kidding why me? She lost. It I flipped. lost this shit. And then Are you Blast fucking kills. kidding me? If she wasn't oh stunned, that was hers to win. If she earlier trashed the apple to the steel, she would have won. That was it. Alright, well, I'm in last. How fun.